Click the click my bell, ding on my bell beside my name where it says subscribed. So that they're not subscribed. Hey, I'm a fucking genius. And also decals are still available. Uh, information and details is all in the description. Um, but yeah, guys, this is as you can see, it's another lovely pissy day in Ireland. I literally checked the weather and it said that it was sunny out. No, it's not fucking sunny. What are you on about? Because I I like. I always check the weather when I when I wake up. Oh, he's very eager. I always check the weather when I get up, so I don't have to open the curtains and wake up Mrs. Dragon because she fucking gives out to me. <laughs> uh, so I, I I check the weather, see what two or three different sites say. They all said it's fucking sunny today. I was like, grand. And then I heard a truck go by, and I was like, no, it sounded a bit you know, squishy. It sounded like water. And then I, I went out the, the front door and I was, ah, uh, bastard. It's piss and rain. It's kind of easing off now. Um, so I don't mind too much. Like, I don't mind the rain. I'm kitted up for the rain. Um, I don't even know, like, I don't know, is the rain getting on the camera from the screen? Oh, that guy just got, or that woman just got sprayed so bad from the truck. <laughs> Um, if there's water staying on the lens, I apologise. There's not much I can do. Um, I'm just glad I'm kind of on this beast for the weather. This thing's fucking filthy. I have to clean it so bad. I've been through some really shitty weather in this. Um, but, you know, speaking of shitty weather, this is what I wanted to talk about. I wanted to talk about kind of the winter. Um, because the winter is coming. And there's probably loads of my subscribers out there that probably haven't been riding too long or have been riding longer than me or maybe just as long as me I wanted to give my advice this is gonna be my fifth or sixth year riding the winter you know the winter really does fucking destroy the bikes and it's actually really so crushing and um, there's a few things I like to do to kind of help my bike um, and myself kind of survived the winter so one of the main things i do is before all the kind of salty weather gets in i'd actually bring my bike to get validated 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 <laughs> and the main reason why i do that is because i don't have the, equi the equipment or the skill to properly clean my bike um and generally they'll range from about 70 to 100 euro to get it validated but what they'll do is a full deep clean and then ACF 50 treat the bike. So you can ACF your bike at home, that's no problem. I rather get the first prep, the first wash done professionally just because I know it's done right. Heel ACF everywhere, pipes, metals, plastics, you name it. So it means when, you know, when the winter actually does hit, the salt isn't gonna corrode your bike. So then what I do throughout the winter is every maybe two or three weeks i'll do it if i know i'm not on the bike in the that the following day or if i'm not on the bike that morning so what i'll do is the previous day i'll acf i'll wash the bike uh, acf 50 and then i'll put it in the garage because the acf kind of needs to dry for a day or two generally overnight i find it's fine uh, and i'll just do that every few weeks just to make sure that there's nothing bad on the bike and I will use a, a pressure washer, um, but you know, everyone says don't use pressure washers. Just be smart with a pressure washer. I said pressure washer a lot more than I want to do in that sentence. <laughs> now, another thing, bike maintenance. Two main things you're going to want on your bike. Tires and brakes. And now there's everything else in between. Tires are going to fucking grip you in the shitty weather. Brakes are going to stop you in the shitty weather. So if you've been putting off tires or um, you know any little bit like that, you know if your tires are starting to square but they still have a few miles left in them, get new tires ASAP. Get either don't get like sports tires because they're gonna have zero grip in the shitty weather. Get something like Angel STs, Angel GTs. Um, my personal favorite, my my all-time favorite used to be the STs and you know what they still are they're fucking great tires loads of grip loads of confidence and they last long 
Only problem with them is they're a bit pricey. So I've moved to Metzler Z8 Interax. They are cheap fucking tires. They're like a hundred and something, like 110 euro for a tire. And they are a savage fucking tire. Loads of grip and they last ages. The tires, get your tires done just so now you can kind of scrub them in properly before the ice and the really shitty weather because it's the end of October now. So, you know, get that done before winter kind of hits. And then brakes, you know, it'd be the time now to kind of actually take your calipers off and clean them. That's something that you can do yourself. You're probably better off doing it yourself because the guards are going to charge you an hour or two labor to clean them properly. Look, guys, they're the two main things you want to do to your bike oil oil and filter and air filter and spark plugs and any chain and sprockets they're not going to stop you in the winter you know if you need to get chain and sprockets done get them done if you need a cheap set to get you over the uh over the winter you know 100 quid get will get you a jt chain and sprocket um they're gonna last you fuck all time but it'll last you enough throughout the winter if that's the way you want to go but brakes and tires are the most important thing um, and also if you're still a bit kind of new to riding and a bit unsure this is the time you want to be practicing as much as possible as much as, as much as you can now i know like you know busy lives you can't really go out and and practice but just go out practicing driving town driving roads like this just really get the feel for your bike especially if it's like a new bike but look guys that's the video hope i've enjoyed let me know if any other guys can share tips i'm gonna do up another video for gear winter gear and um, to be honest i don't really own winter gear um i just kind of just fucking brave the elements badass motherfucker oh it's fucking i'm on petrol now lovely jubbly look guys that's the video hope i've enjoyed like comment and subscribe I'll talk to you on the next video.